fine. This is fine. <laughs> I'm Kelsey and I thought it would be funny to try the 100 infant challenge a challenge at the Sims 4 where you have one matriarch and you're supposed to have 100 infants all in one lifespan the rules are simple it's similar to the 100 baby challenge except for you can age up toddlers after only having three skills and I can mod my house so that I can have unlimited amounts of children all within my home I've been kind of dreading filming this because last time I had science babies and I thought that you would be pregnant with the science babies but you just have them immediately so now I have for babies on top of the multiple infants and toddlers that I already have. If we survive today's episode, I will be the proudest I've ever been. I'm a little bit learning as I go with making this a speed run. And I think I've learned that I might have bit off more than I can chew. If you aren't already subscribed, what are you doing? Hit that subscribe bell, join the family, and you'll be notified every time a new video goes live. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's hop into the video. <laughs> All right, so we back, baby. So we've got Cecilia, who is hungry. Belle, who is going to bed, and she's fine. Bo is happy as a clam. We got Madeline and Chloe, both of whom are needing hygiene as usual. And then we got Rosalie, Rowan, Ellie, and Elsie. Awesome. Before I unpause this and enter the chaos, I just want really quick to adjust one thing. It's something I've done in my past challenges. I just find it always super helpful. I think I need that now. So we're gonna get one of these ridge displays so we can put it up there for our Todd. Hopefully they can reach it. I don't know about this house. This house is crazy looking, but we needed that display, so that's good. I'm like taking deep breaths here. I forgot about this disgusting salad. We'll move it over here so the Todds can eat for themselves. Who needs attention first? I feel like Madeline is fine. Maybe we focus on Chloe. Let's bottle feed Chloe. Oh my God, all of the children are upset. All right, you kids. Cecilia, if you're hungry, go grab a salad, please. Stop trying to play with your sisters. Bo is gonna go play with his sister. Oh my gosh, a laugh unlocked. Oh my God, the toddlers are here to witness the laugh being unlocked. That is too cute. It's Rosalie and Rowan's birthday today. And tomorrow Tomorrow is Ellie's birthday, but the next day are the twins. So we will get them all aged up shortly. I think our first order of business is aging up our girl here. She just needs to get to level two of potty and then we're good to go. So, all right, Chelsea, while well, you're still feeling pretty good. Oh God, everything is bad. There are constantly kids crying. You're outshined by Madeline, Bo. Are you serious right now? Why don't you play in some stuff? And Madeline, I will get with you in a moment. We're figuring out Chloe right now. We're getting her hygiene taken care of. Belle's doing great. She's having fun. Hearing these babies cry is absolutely terrible. Chloe got her first bubble bath. Good job, Chloe. Chelsea is miserable. Chelsea, don't worry. We get a hundred simoleons for everything we do here. Oh my God, all the babies are crying. This is mayhem. I normally don't just let children cry, but okay, Cecilia, you need to learn to potty. She has three skills. It's just none of them are potty, which is frustrating. Bo, Oh, can you use the potty? No, you need potty help as well. And Bo's pretty tired. So Bo, why don't you come to sleep? Chelsea's feeding Madeline who needs sleep and attention. Let's also give Madeline a bath. Rowan is very hungry. He'll be taken away soon. Okay, then no bath. We need to fix Rowan. Wh which one is Rowan? That's Ellie, Elsie. This one's Rowan. Let's bottle feed Rowan and then we'll start taking care of babies. Oh my God, Madeline's gonna be in this loud room. She's not gonna wanna go night night because it's gonna be too loud. I'm just trying to stay calm. This is insanity. We need all the kids to go to bed. All right, we're trying, we're getting here. Most of my kids are asleep, except for Madeline, who like does not seem to be able to go to sleep. Belle is also not asleep. Oh my God, all the kids are waking up. Go back to sleep. Mom is not ready for you yet, and mom's gonna pass out very soon. My God, all these babies. Chelsea's miserable. Do we have any satisfaction points? I don't think we have enough to fix her needs. At least all the other kids are asleep. Okay, what is wrong, Elsie? Elsie's hungry. Okay, great. Well, why don't you feed her? Are you feeding her? Please, thank you. Mail's been delivered. We have bills to pay. That's fine. You can handle bills at this point. Can you go to bed, sweetie? I know it, you're really tired and you need attention, but try just to go night night, okay? You're really, really exhausted. Madeline, go to sleep. Chelsea also needs to sleep. Oh no! What is wrong? 
wrong. Oh my God, I can't go to sleep until we find out what's wrong with this baby. Chelsea's so not gonna be able to sleep. Okay, go to sleep, Chelsea. Just sleep through the babies. They're gonna be fine. Oh my God, <laughs> no. Oh God, Chelsea's definitely gonna pee herself. Chelsea, just ignore the kids for a second. I need to get your needs up. All the kids will survive. They're all gonna be fine, probably. Why don't you take a shower quickly? Oh my God, Chelsea's really gonna pass out. Everything is disgusting. Oh my God, these kids are gonna kill me. What day is today? Oh my God, two of the kids' birthdays. I can't, I can't. Okay, they're gonna kill me. They are going to kill me. What is wrong with our infant? What's wrong with Madeline? Oh my God, Madeline cannot sleep. Okay, we're going to try to feed Madeline and then we're gonna try to put her down out of the room so she can actually sleep because these babies are nonstop. Why don't you go to sleep, sweetie? She's too scared. Okay, go nap. I thought there was a nightlight in the room. There is one. I don't know why you're scared. And Chelsea's passing out. Oh my God. Okay, 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 okay. How do we fix this? How do I fix her sleep without her sleeping? Maybe we need some music. Music would be good. Make everybody happy. I don't know. <laughs> My other thought is like, we could leave the house. I know it's not like ideal and it might be a little bit akin to cheating, but the kids normally are in better moods when we arrive back at the house. And we do probably want Chelsea to get pregnant so we can stop her aging. The problem is Chelsea is gonna pass out wherever she goes. So we would just leave the house to go sleep, which doesn't make much sense. But I don't know how she's gonna sleep regardless. Listen to kids music. Okay, why don't you listen to the kids radio once you wake up? Hopefully that'll give you a little bit of satisfaction points will get up to the 400 point, which maybe will be enough for your sleep. Is that enough? Listen to kids music, the jams. Perfect. Okay, we just hit 420. And this one says chat with someone. All right, why don't you chat with your little son here? The amount of baby crying is terrifying, honestly. Okay, we just need to maybe do one more thing. Watch a romantic TV show. Certainly. She's definitely going to fall asleep. Okay, we got 470. We just need one more. What's this say? Be friendly with Gunther. <laughs> crap. Make a new friend. How do we make a new friend? Or be friendly with Gunther. Honestly, I don't know if we can do those two things. Her need is really just hunger and energy. Hunger we can probably fix if we just buy an apple from the store. Ooh, let's buy a bunch of mushrooms and she could just eat them out of her inventory. It's not the best, but it's not the worst. And we just need to fix her sleep. So let's reward insta sleep, sleep replacement. Fabulous. So now we just need her to drink that and then she can eat her little things and we'll move on. Push forward. Okay, drink, drink your little drinky girl. All you got babies to take care of. You're literally surviving off of reward. Wait, what did you just do? Girl, 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 what are you doing? Drink that. You will not be able to take care of your children if you don't drink that. Chelsea's like, forget my energy drinks. I need to take care of my kids. All right, her sleep has been replaced. Fantastic. Why don't you eat some mushrooms? Okay, we're gonna just snack as we go. And then who's up first? Cecilia's asleep. How's Belle? Belle's asleep. Bo needs some hygiene, but he'll be fine. Bo, why don't you play with some toys? Chloe is very hungry, but I feel like Madeline's the one that needs like the most attention right now. So let's give a bubble bath to Madeline. I need her to be out of this room or just feed her or something. Like what is happening? Oh my God, stop talking to me, child. I'm trying to, oh my God, stop it, stop it. I know you need help. You all need, oh my God. I've been trying to take care of one child. And for some reason, the way that this game is routing is just absolutely terrible. Madeline just keeps falling asleep because she's so exhausted. We just need to feed her. Just give her a bath, child. Chelsea, please. Chelsea, please. Uh, you're wasting time. We're at least moving her outside. That's better than what was happening before. Can you feed her, please? Okay, we're feeding her. This is absolutely terrible. Like, Chelsea, I'm trying to go one at a time, but Madeline's been waiting the longest. Madeline's absolutely devastated, but luckily she won't die now, okay? She's gonna get her bath, and then we're gonna put her down. The amount of crying babies is astronomical. Ellie's very hungry. Okay, which one's Ellie? This is Ellie. If I get a child ticket, in a way, I'm gonna be very stressed about this. Chelsea! Oh my God, I'm gonna murder my Sims. I'm having to pause because Chelsea has a mind of her own. She keeps trying to take care of these kids and I'm like, I have an order, okay? I have a plan. You just need to let it happen. And now you need to try to go night night, okay? There we go. All right, Chelsea, go for it. Okay, we need to start feeding all these babies. The poor toddlers, I don't even know what's going on with them. They are literally having to just survive on their own. It's absolute anarchy here. The poor babies. And then what do you, what's, what's your deal? You're just 
just so sad. Part of me just thinks that I should just age her up or maybe we'll sign him up for preschool. Oh yeah, we'll send him to preschool. Perfect, private, it's $50 each school day. Fun learning environment, okay. Yeah, let's sign them all up for preschool. This might be the hack. We're gonna really quick wake you up and sign you up for preschool as well. You're all going private because I think we can afford it. All of you need to go to bed now. <laughs> Due to neglect, Rowan is being whisked away to safety. Maybe you should consider goldfish before jumping into parenthood again. Oh my God, we've had one baby removed. <sighs> Crap! I thought I was doing so well. I've literally never in all of my 100 baby challenges ever had a baby taken away. So this is so sad. I don't even know if I got a warning. I'm so sorry, Rowan. This makes me super duper sad. I can't believe it. But also part of me is a little bit happy. I'm not gonna lie. Mostly just because I am overwhelmed. I feel like I should not have done it. So you know what, Rowan? Maybe you'll have a happier life. Elsie is gonna be taken away. We're feeding Elsie now. I've never had kids taken away before. Oh my goodness. I'm so sad. I found my limit apparently. And having four babies, two infants, and three toddlers is apparently my limit. Knowing your limits is important. I just feel so bad. Poor Rowan. But we're doing our very best out here. Oh my god. And Rosalie aged up. Rowan was like seconds away from becoming an infant too. Rosalie is a wiggly infant. Fantastic. And she just smiled for the first time. I've got too many babies. Oh my gosh. The babies are officially fine, so that's good. Rosalie is hungry, so let us feed Rosalie, and then we're gonna put her down out of the room. Good job, kids, for eating your salads. I guess I need to make some more salad. Oh my God, it's absolutely filthy. Okay, let's clean this up. Let's cook a, like a big salad. Maybe I'll do like a big old casserole or something. Hopefully that'll keep all my Sims fuller longer. Oh my God, who's here? It's Knox. You know what? Come on in, Knox. Happy spitter. Rosalie is prone to spit during feeding. Fantastic. I can't wait for my toddlers to start going to preschool. That's for sure. All my Sims are miserable. Okay, we did a casserole for the kids. Thank goodness. All right, we're gonna go check on our babies. Chloe definitely, definitely needs support. Emotional, physical, mental. Oh my God, all my babies are gonna be devastated. I think I need to like slow down. I thought at first that I could handle all of this, but as much as I was really wanting to do a speed run, I don't know if it's literally possible. But here we go. We're fixing little Chloe's needs. I haven't even had time to even look at the poor toddlers who need to be aging up. She just needs to be taught how to go potty like one more time. Wrap it up here. Now we need to use the bathroom, eat some more of our mushrooms here. Quickly, Chelsea, quickly. Everyone is always sad. She grabbed your little toes. Madeline, you're doing amazing, sweetie. Oh, it's Ellie and Elsie's birthday. Yeah, time does fly. She's taking care of our infant here. We're feeding her good. Hey, Chelsea, you're feeling good. At least we have a lot of money, you know? Unfortunately, money cannot fix most of our problems unless we hire an extra caregiver, which we can try, but it is a speed run. The goal was for me to do it, but oh my God, is the speed run not speeding? Let's try to just really quickly potty train Cecilia while everyone's just kind of chilling. Okay, schools are open. Belle should go to school soon. Yay! Okay, let's all go to school, kids. Cecilia was almost at level two. Go to school. I'm sorry, Cecilia. Goodbye, kids. Have fun. All my Todd's are going off to school to learn. This is fantastic. We can now deal with the babies in front of us. Okay, so you just need hygiene and sleep. So let's give you a little bubble bath to Madeline. <laughs> Both back from school? Why are you back from school? You go back to school. No back from school yet. Oh my God, Cecilia learned a skill at school. She could go potty. That's amazing. Good job, kids. Cecilia is now level two on potty. She just needs to get up to level three. Oh my God, the babies are up again. I was just trying to get a hold of these toddlers. You're done. Get her out of the bath. Chelsea is exhausted. Oh my God, we didn't even pay our bills. We have money to pay our bills. We just didn't pay them because I haven't remembered or had time to. This is very bad, guys. I don't know how anyone's done the seven intimate challenge. And Madeline peed on Chelsea. Fantastic. Jay Huntington's like, let's go to a festival. Jay Huntington, I'm fighting for my life out here. Chloe is very hungry. So let's focus on Chloe. Rosalie is also desperately in need of food. I know you're tired, Chelsea. Just hold on. I don't think I have any more 
more satisfaction. No. So I can't fix her needs again like I did last time. I can keep eating these random mushrooms though. Fixing her food a little bit. All right, we're feeding our babies. Can you guys just not go to bed? Go to bed. Chloe, you need to fall asleep. Go to bed. You guys need to sleep. Chelsea's parody level nine. Let's go. We're so close. Yes, they just became good friends. All right, it's happening. We're gonna make it, I think. I think. I think. Cecilia's back home from school. Good job, Cecilia. You're level two. Oh my God, you're level fours. You've gotten some good skills. You're level two on potty. Okay, Cecilia, here's all you gotta do, okay? I just need you to keep going potty. Do not stop until you reach the next level. It is up to you, Cecilia. You are our only hope. You will save this family single-handedly. Oh no, they all need baths, but the rest of their needs are pretty good. I need you all to sleep for a minute while Chelsea handles these babies. Okay, finally, we've got Ellie asleep. Okay, can we get some sleep? I don't know, maybe. Chelsea's fun is like, what is fun? I don't know her. Oh my God. They're all waking each other up and it's bad. Everybody's also very stinky. I wonder if we put like a splash pad for the toddlers, if they can splash in it and then they'll get cleaner. Is that crazy? I feel like that makes sense. It's really trying all the hacks. Here's a splash pad. Is your hygiene going up? How come your hygiene is not going up? At least their fun is the going up though. So that's cute. It's not what I wanted, but it's cute. You know, go back to sleep, Chelsea. I know you're going to pass out again. Shush that baby. The babies are constant. It's so frustrating. That didn't fix any of her hygiene at all, which is annoying. Cecilia, how are you doing? She is tired, she needs fun, and she needs hygiene. Soon you'll be able to help me clean up the house, and that's what's most important. And you'll be able to help with your siblings. I'm so sorry that it's all down to you, girl. At least I haven't peed myself yet this episode. Like, that's pretty impressive. A win is a win. Did we lose a kid? Yes, for the first time in 100 baby history, we did lose a kid. But we learned some valuable life lessons that I shouldn't bite off more than I can chew, even though it is a speed challenge. Cecilia reached level three of the potty skill. Let's go. Okay, Chelsea, forget everything I told you. I need you to bake a cake. You're gonna age up your child. This is first and foremost. Chelsea's gonna make you a cake. Everything's gonna be okay. Oh, and she's gonna pass out. I'm gonna watch this cake while Chelsea passes out. Hopefully no one steals a bit of it. All right, let's help blow out candles for Cecilia. Here we go, it's happening, guys. We're aging up our first child. Thank goodness. Woohoo, Cecilia aged up. Okay, she's a dog lover and, ooh, multi-skill. What's that mean? Oh, this one's the new child stuff. Pick a number one through floor. Four, okay, she's going to be a mind and body. Wants to master both her mind and body. And she's got little bunny ears, which is very cute. Yeah, she has so many needs that she needs to take care of, but she can do it on her own. Let me get her a bed. I think this is doable. Why don't you, my little king, go to sleep? And Cecilia, take a shower. Like, what is happening here? Oh, Madeline's really hungry. Okay. And Rosalie, you need to sleep too. Oh my God, Chelsea's passing out again. This is terrible. Oh my goodness, no. This is going very, very badly. Maybe we'll just age these two up really quick. I don't know if that's better or worse. <laughs> I don't know. I'm like so close to just giving up and cheating needs at this point, which is against the rules. I can't, I can't. I haven't had a single kid in this episode. I think the key is maybe just to get older siblings quicker. And then we could maybe, maybe, be able to get some sleep and keep being pregnant. So I feel like we can make it all go faster. I think we just need to focus on aging up these initial Sims here. Why are you both crying? Madeline is very hungry. She's gonna get taken away. Of course she is. I kind of figured that actually. I don't wanna get an infant taken away. A baby is one thing because I haven't gotten emotionally attached, but no way am I getting an infant taken away. I refuse to get my infants taken away. Absolutely not. Not my babies. When is your birthday? It's just tomorrow. You have to hold on one more day and you guys can be toddlers and take care of yourself mostly. It's gonna be okay. Chloe needs food. Oh God, she's gonna fall asleep. Just go to sleep, Madeline, you need to. And Chelsea's gonna pass out. I feel so guilty about all these children. Oh no, at least my kids and toddlers are perfect baby angels. I feel so bad that I'm just abandoning them and I'm not able to spend any quality time with any of these kids because I just had too many. It was an accident. I didn't mean to have them all at once. It could have happened to any Anybody. Chelsea could probably die from her needs, honestly, at some point. Even Chelsea's just sat down. She's like, I need a flipping moment. You know what?
but no one's dying right now. So you can go take a shower if you really need to. I think I've suffered enough. I don't want my kids taken away. So I'm gonna actually have Chelsea leave the house. We need to leave Chelsea. We need to travel away. You're gonna sleep there and we're gonna find a new woohoo buddy. We're going to the library. She's gonna take a nap. The kids will go to daycare. We'll get the support that they need. And we need to find a new lover for babies anyway. We need to become pregnant again. Not maybe this second, obviously, but at some point soon. Go nap, Chelsea. I know you're uncomfy, but it is what it is, girl. At least you're getting some sleep. Hopefully the kids' needs will get better. Hey, Cecilia's going to school. Good job, Cecilia. Oh, Bell reached potty level two. All I had to do was avoid my children and they are all better for it. Ellie and Elsie aged up. So now we have one, two, three, four, five infants. People are starting to show up. Well, I am not seeing any single people here. Where are all the hot single people? Where are all the hot people? So I think it might be time for you guys to start uploading your single parents to the gallery. All right, well, this was like a fail. That was the, literally the whole point in going out. I mean, besides getting her needs up and hopefully getting the children's needs up by leaving them behind. Well, Chelsea's needs are all fixed for the most part. Maybe we'll give her one last nap. Okay, what about you? Harrison Miranda. Dang it, he also is married. Oh my gosh, it's Madeline and Chloe's birthdays. All right, well, we probably should age them up and go home. Not seeing anyone that we could woohoo. Kind of a bust, but also good for Chelsea because she deserved it. She needed it. How are my kids? Belle is great. Bo is great. Madeline, great. Chloe, great. Rosalie, great. Ellie, great. Oh my God, all my kids are fine. This feels a little like cheating, but I'm gonna say it's not. There was no other way to do this. What happened here? Where happened to my, excuse me? It's like my house reset. All these things that I had bought are gone. Okay, I think this has gotta be a glitch in The Sims right now because kind of reverted back to an old save, which is very odd. So we do need to age up two of my kids, but I kind of don't think it's in here anymore. Yeah, I have to remake my stuff here, which is silly. We're making ourselves fruit salad and then I think we need to cook a cake for the twins so that they can become toddlers. Even though I already made a cake. Oh, maybe I'll make a hamburger cake, which I've actually made in real life. If you haven't watched the video yet, go check it out. It is hilarious. And it's a delicious cake. You're uncomfortable? Why don't you go to sleep, sweetheart? Can she help with any of these babies? She can't. She can entertain them though. She can be like nice to them, but she can't actually feed any of them, which is a little bit odd to me, but that's okay. I love there's just a kid on the floor and our foot is in their head. Like really nice. And now we opened up a oven on top of the kid. <laughs> Poor Rosalie. It's Madeline and Chloe's birthday today. I'm very excited. We can help Madeline and Chloe blow out candles. I've actually never aged up a toddler this way before. So this will be so cute to get to see this. It's all you. I'm sorry for your traumatic infancy. That was on me. Oh, it's so cute. Madeline aged up and she is a charmer and Madeline had earned a bonus trait. Oh, that's cute from being sunny. Oh, and she's a charmer. That's so sweet. Sweet. Okay, Chelsea, why don't you add some candles again? So sweet, look at her first steps. Okay, now we have three toddlers. We're about to have four toddlers. Todd Mageddon is not nearly as terrible as Infant Mageddon. Okay, let's help out candles for Chloe now. Chloe, and then we'll only have three infants, which will be good, I think. Happy birthday, little Chloe. Oh, and she's still cautious and she's angelic. Okay, I'm getting some good luck in toddlers. And look at these two celebrating their new little sister who's got a lot of hair. Oh my goodness, so much hair. We're gonna put the little candles on, we're gonna put that away, and then we're gonna check on all our kids and see who needs attention. So you are fine. Bo needs to use the toilet, so let's potty train Bo. And then how are you, Madeline? You're good. Why don't you just go to bed? Because you're a little tired. Chloe, how you doing? You're a little hungry. Why don't you grab a serving of some food? Rosalie's also a little hungry. Ellie is a little hungry and a little sleepy. Ellie, why don't you try to go night-night? Elsie is, wow, just back here with the head in a pile of food. Also a little hungry. Okay, she did not potty train Bo like I asked her to. She's gonna listen to Bo's question though, which is cute. He's like, do you love me, mom? And she's like, of course, Bo, I love you. I am sorry that I am not the best mom. Go get Elsie, Chelsea. Okay, my kids are all like mostly good, which is incredible. We're doing it, team. Oh, Rosalie.
Rosalie and Elsie just unlocked some milestones. So cute. I think it was just having babies and infants at the same time. That was the big no. I feel like I can finally tread water again. Chelsea's needs are okay. They're not great, but they're not bad. Bo is still like, oh, mommy won't pay attention to me. I'm sorry. Oh, we have a family dynamic that they like to joke with each other. She's cleaning the bathroom. Oh my God, a thing I never thought we could do. Yeah, we're gonna go to bed. I'm sorry if any kids are up. Ellie, please don't wake up your siblings. Please don't wake up your siblings. Yes, they're all asleep. Oh, my sibs are asleep at once. This is incredible. Oh my gosh, they woke up. Oh my gosh, my kids can go to preschool. I forgot. All right, you're all going to preschool. You get to go to preschool and you get to go to preschool. Chelsea's up. She's a little embarrassed. All right, take a little shower quickly, so Chelsea, before you go take care of all the kids. Oh my God, it's Harvest Fest. And Chelsea loves all of the things. I don't know if we're gonna have time, Chelsea. All right, Chelsea, go give Elsie a bath. And we've got two other bebes that need some attention. Okay, and now we need to check on whose needs are worse. Okay, Rosalie's needs are worse. All right, so let's feed Rosalie. Sorry, Ellie, you're next in line. Oh my gosh, what a day it's being right now. I wish I could just give him a little sink baths. A little quick, like just dunk him in some water and let him go, you know? I love that Cecilia is gonna be like, I will be the one to invite this person. And oh my God, also the toddlers are returning. Oh, he's frightened by this child. Are you okay, Dave? Like, what is your deal? It's just a kid. It's not that deep. All right, we're giving a bath again. Rosalie's the only one who is fussing. Rosalie, can you just go to sleep? Oh, how are you hungry again already? I literally just fed all of you. Oh my God, he's helping. Oh my God, with his own child. That's very sweet. Bo, say thank you. Bo, talk to your sister. Can you play together? Family kiss, you are my favorite. Oh my God, that's too funny. Likes discussing interests. Cute. She loved hearing about Bo discuss his interests about princesses. She loves all of her little siblings. Come on, Dave, you can do it. Try a little bit. Just try a little. Why is Rosalie upset again? Rosalie needs, oh my God, there's just so many kids and I'm just stressing. The infants are gonna kill me. Now both of them are upset. Are you kidding me? I just gave you a bath. You go to sleep. Don't you dare act like I don't care. Come on, Rosalie, let's go take a bath. As usual, I'm constantly bathing my children. At least the toddlers are just hanging out with each other. It is wild to me that the toddlers are the easiest ones to take care of. Wait, Bo is almost to level three of communication. Bo, if you just keep communicating, I'll age you up. Oh my gosh, that'll be so great. What about you, Madeline? Belle is level three on three items and she's almost level three on potty. Belle, do you wanna just like finish going potty and then I'll age you up? Let's go, Belle. Belle is crushing. She's just like, I'm an independent queen. All of you toddlers come watch Belle potty. All the toddlers are coming in to watch Belle. Perfect. How you doing, Chelsea? Ooh, Elsie learned how to laugh. And look how proud Cecilia is. Cecilia's finally having some quality time with Chelsea. And all the Todds are watching the potty action happen. All of you need to go to sleep now. It is 7 p.m., so. Woohoo! Belle reached level three of potty. Let's go! Which means we can age up Belle. Ha cha cha. Why don't you help Belle blow out the candle? She's got three level three skills, including potty. Bo, you're up next. We just need to potty train you. Yes, yes, yes! Okay, that's two, baby. Two children in the house. We're getting there. We're getting there. Okay, Belle loves the outdoors and pick a number one through five, four. And she is a social butterfly. Fantastic. Okay, Chelsea, why don't you have some fun? fun with Cecilia, a little family kiss. Why don't we appease the gnome? I think these ones like future cubes. Bella's having a snack. And then why don't you give this one, I think it's coffee. Yeah, good job, Belle. See, we're getting there with like having quality time with our girls. We're gonna try to make this house have a good holiday. The impeachish maze deserve a nice holiday. There you go, look how nice that is. Cecilia is hungry and needs some snacks. Sleep. So why don't Cecilia, you have some applesauce and then I think you could go to bed in mom's bed since your sister Belle has decided to fall asleep in the bed that you normally sleep in. Oh, and Belle has like the cutest little like dress with glasses.
glasses to go to sleep. How cute is she? It's getting to be that time where everyone needs to go to bed. Chelsea's gonna really quick potty train her bebe. For once, the Todds are all kind of chilling and sleeping, which is good. Nope, we got one up. Oh my gosh, Chloe reached potty level two. Good job, Chloe. That means that you can just learn on your own. This is gonna be fantastic. All right, kids, let's go. Come on, Chelsea. I know you're exhausted, but you just need to finish up this day and then you probably can go to bed. Did Rosalie even get a bath? No, she did not. What is happening here? Finish fixing her needs. Okay, nope, she's gonna pass out. We have no reward point. Chelsea's just gonna fall asleep and all the toddlers are waking up and mad and hungry. All of their needs are terrible. Cecilia, I need you to age up so quickly, please. Harvest Fest was successful though. Okay, let's see all of your guys' needs and who has the worst needs right now. Ellie has the worst needs. Come on, Chelsea, go, go, go. The second hungriest is Rosalie. We'll just feed them and then we'll try to maybe let them just sleep it off. Oh my God, she's like, you just did a blowout? Wait, are you kidding me? Rosalie, I literally just fixed you. Try to go night night, okay? We're gonna just sit in that diaper for a minute. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. We officially have two kids, three toddlers and three infants. So we have eight kids in total. We've actually gone down one since the last episode, which is really sad. I do truly believe once we have some like teens in the house that I will start being able to have more kids and like do more of the speed run. I would think I just went in guns blazing. And to be honest, um, I could not hang and I needed to take it step down. That's okay. We all learned something. We're doing our very best with all these kids, giving them all the love and attention they all deserve. And they're supporting each other. They're going to be one big happy family very soon. I think it's just for it. The roughest patch I think I've ever experienced in this challenge. So yeah, this was great. Leave your baby names in the comments below and I'll see you again next week. Bye.